What's happening everyone, my name is Alex and welcome back. In today's video I'm going to show you how to easily spot the fake Apple AirPods Pro 2. So this is the second generation of the Apple AirPods Pro. And even though these were out for only about a month and a half, well unfortunately there are a lot of fakes out there already. Just to give you an example, if you open the Facebook marketplace, most of those AirPods being sold there are in fact fake. So if you don't buy your AirPods directly from Apple or an authorized reseller, well, there is a really high chance that you're going to end up buying the fake ones, believing that you're buying the original ones. So hopefully by the end of this video, you're going to have enough information so you don't end up buying the fake ones, believing that you're buying the original ones, because nobody wants to spend $200 on a pair of fake um, Apple AirPods. I've actually done similar videos in the past on other Apple products and there are thousands of comments from people that got scammed uh, into buying the fake ones. So always try to buy your Apple products directly from Apple or an authorized um, reseller. Okay, and with that being said, let's start by checking out the boxes and see what's different for the box of the original one and the box on the fake ones. Alright, so the boxes are pretty similar. Now, the colors on them are a bit different, but realistically, if you don't have both boxes in hand, you're not going to be able to tell if you're looking at the fake ones or the real ones. If you look at the stickers on the side of the boxes there, well, those stickers may actually be different depending on the region where you're buying these. My original Apple AirPods Pro 2 are bought in um, Europe, so that's how the sticker will look if you're buying them in Europe, but um, the sticker may actually be different if you buy them I don't know, in China or in North America. So the stickers could be different than what you're seeing on um, your screen right now. Now, the easiest way to spot if you're looking at a fake or real box is actually on the back of the box. So they both have those pulling tabs on the back. Now, if you look really close, you're going to notice that on the original box, um, just underneath that um, pulling tab, we have a straight line. If you look on the fake box close enough, you're going to notice that we have little holes there. So to make it easier to open that um, tab. So if you have the little holes there, you're definitely looking at a fake um, box. When you actually pull on those tabs, on the original box, those tabs will be in one piece. So it's just going to open the box straight and nice. On the fake box, those tabs will actually break because those tabs are made out of um, paper where the tabs on the original box are made out of some plastified paper. So that's not going to break on the original box. So you can see the difference whenever opening an original box and whenever opening a fake box. So that's probably your first thing that you should look at um, whenever you're buying these um, AirPods Pro 2. So when you open the boxes, you're going to find that little cardboard pouch that contains the user manual and some information um, booklets. Now, the user manuals are pretty similar, so you're not going to be able to tell um, just by looking at those. But pay attention when you remove that little cardboard pouch that contains the user manual. If you look on the original box, you're going to notice that the charging case is nicely wrapped with a pull-out tab right at the top. On the fake box, the charging case is wrapped in plastic, but there is no pull-out tab and that wrapping job is not the greatest out there. So that should be your second hint that you're looking at some fake Apple AirPods Pro 2. That plastic wrap around the charging case, it's also much easier to open on the original um, Apple AirPods Pro 2 compared to the fake ones. So the fake ones, you do have to work a bit to actually get that um, plastic off the case. Once you remove the charging cases from the box, take this out and take a look at it. On the original box, this is actually made out of cardboard. It does feel nice and sturdy, where on the fake box, this is actually made out of plastic. It does um, seem quite flimsy. So this is another tip of something that you should look at um, if you bought some um, Apple AirPods Pro 2 from a different place than Apple, for example. Once you remove those, you can also look inside the boxes. So you're going to notice that the original box is very well made. There are no gaps anywhere. Everything looks straight. Where on the fake box, there are a lot of um, gaps. Those um, cardboard parts there don't look straight. So look for small details like that. Also, the cable that comes in the box on the original ones um, is nice and round. So you can see how it sits there in the box nicely where the cable on the fake ones looks kind of messy. Even though uh, that little box that contains the ear tips is a bit different and you can see some holes um, the way those um, ear tips are positioned in there. 
on the original ones that uh, you cannot see on the fake ones. So look for small details all the time. Moving on to the charging cases, well this time around with these fake Apple AirPods Pro 2, the charging case here looks pretty much identical. The only difference that I've noticed is on the back where we have the text. So the text on the fake one um, does seem a bit darker than the text that we have on the original. However, you're not going to be able to tell if you don't have the original and the fake um, side by side. So the charging cases do look pretty much um, identical. Now, when you open the charging cases at the top there, um, the writing is a bit different on the fake ones compared to the original ones. However, that writing could also be different depending on the market where um, you're buying the Apple AirPods Pro 2. So keep that in mind. In my case, the text is a bit um, different. The serial number that we have on the fake ones there also matches the serial number that we have on the box. And of course, this is also the case for the original ones. So the serial number on the charging case matches the serial number that we have um, on the box. Moving on to the actual AirPods. Well, when you first glance at them, they do look pretty similar. I have to say that it's hard to actually tell which ones are the fake ones and the real ones. Now, if you look really, really close um, at the serial numbers on them, so on the fake ones, they have the same serial number on both um, AirPods, and this is the same serial number that we also have on the charging case and on the box. For the original Apple AirPods Pro 2 and pretty much all other AirPods, the serial numbers on each AirPod is different, so they are not the same serial number that you get on the box and on the charging um, Okay, so keep that in mind. If you have the same serial number on all four things, you're probably looking at some fake ones. I've also noticed on the fake ones that that black mesh material that probably covers some microphones that are used for noise cancelling seems to be fake. So it's just a piece of plastic on the fake ones, where on the real ones we do seem to have an actual mesh covering those microphones. So look for very, very small details, even though you do need really good eyes to actually see those because, well, the AirPods are pretty small. Next, pay attention what happens and what message you get when you first open the charging case next to your iPhone. So on the fake ones here, we get a message saying not your Apple AirPods Pro. So a different message than what you get with the original ones. So always pay attention to what happens when you first pair these to your phone. Once connected to your iPhone, open the settings app and scroll down till um, you see the Apple AirPods Pro 2. That's how it shows up for the fake ones. On the original ones, you actually get Apple AirPods um, Pro. So click on that, open that and scroll all the way to the bottom. Basically, with the original ones, you're going to see the warranty expiration date. And that should be basically a year from the time that um, you open them. With the fake ones, there is actually no... Uh, warranty information there whatsoever. Now I did have other fake Apple AirPods and with those uh, my phone actually told me that I may be looking at some fake ones. Well I don't get that message for these particular fakes that I got but keep in mind there is no um, warranty information when you open uh, that on your phone. I've also noticed another small thing with this. So open the case, take out the AirPods out of the case and put them next to the case, so not in your ears. Then um, go to your Bluetooth settings and then you can actually turn on uh, the noise cancellation on the fake ones, where on the original ones you cannot turn on the noise cancellation unless you have them in your ears. So if they're just sitting next to your phone there, you shouldn't be able to turn on the noise cancellation on the original ones. The fake ones will allow you to do that. Now, these fake ones also have noise cancellation, but there is a massive difference for the noise cancellation quality that you get from the original ones and the fake ones. Unfortunately, if you don't try both of them, of course, you're not going to be able to tell the difference. But yes, there is a massive difference how the noise cancellation works on the original ones compared to these fake ones. Now for sound quality, I was actually surprised by the sound quality that we get from these ones. These ones actually sound like the original Apple AirPods Pro. So even though the original Apple AirPods Pro 2 sound a bit better, I was actually surprised by the sound that I got from these. 
But the biggest difference you're basically gonna notice for that uh, noise cancellation feature and the transparency mode. So those don't work that well on the fake ones. Of course, you can also check Apple's website, enter the serial number and see what comes up. But realistically, the serial number on the fake ones is probably just copied from some real uh, Apple AirPods Pro 2. So that's not necessarily the way um, to go and checking to see if you have the real ones or um, the fake ones. So there you have it guys, hopefully I made it a bit easier buying um, your next Apple AirPods Pro 2. Always remember that if possible it is ideal to buy this directly from Apple or an authorized reseller. This way you don't have any issues, you're gonna get the original product, the original product works better than the fake one and so on. So always try to buy this directly from um, Apple. Alright guys, hopefully this video was useful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.